Today I would like to cover a recent controversy which involves a manufacturer by the name of SCG. Before I start this video, I would like to say that I do not intend to offend anyone on the team working at SCG and their owner. I've met the company's owner, Jim, before, and while I do not know him too well, he is still a very nice person nonetheless. I also do not want to harm their image as a brand, as that is not the objective of this video. My objective is to criticize an opinion that I don't agree with. So about a few days ago, Jim said, The flag drops at real race courses, where real race cars race each other in real races. Everything else is meaningless BS. Jim. You might be seeing where this is going, but this made a lot of people in the sim racing community mad. Jim says to take your daily to a local drag strip or autocross, and while that might actually be cheaper than a sim setup, that doesn't mean a sim setup is BS. I'm not trying to say that sim racing is real racing because obviously it's not real, that's why it's called sim racing. This is kind of a little bit of gatekeeping. Even though sim racing is not real, it's still racing and it's still a competition, and many people love it. Sim racing has also helped the careers of many up and coming racing drivers, which means it really isn't useless BS. I don't want to drag this video out too long, but the note I want to end it on is racing is racing whether it's real or virtual, and it's for everyone, and everyone deserves to be a part of the racing community. I'm going to end the video here because I think it's a good conclusion for my opinion. See you all later. Take care.